Hi, this is Riyas. This is Paramedicogenesis. Nowadays, the surgery is without anesthesia is impossible. A good anesthesia have a various factor. The main factor is it's an anesthesia machine. So in this video, we will learn about the anesthesia machine of parts as a simple line diagram. Before start the video, let's intro. As far as Anastasia machine is concerned, it was invented by Dr. Henry Edward Koskin Royal in 1917. So nowadays the Anastasia machine is evolved very beautifully. Now we have to use Anastasia wood station, it's a very advanced Anastasia machine. So we have to learn about the voice apparatus. We have we should know about the, the parts of voice apparatus. So in this video, we have to learn about the parts of Anesthesia machine in simple diet diagram. So consider it is an anesthesia gas cylinders. Oh, three cylinders is here. So one is a air, so medical air gas cylinders. So another is a nitrous oxide gas cylinders. So one last but not least is a oxygen gas cylinders. So it's have a cylinder. After the cylinder, we have to draw over the line. So it is a air line, it's a nitrous oxide line, and that is a oxygen line. Again, line is sweet. So oxygen line. So first is a check valve is here. So check valve is here and check valve is here. And that check valve is called a unidirectional check valve. So unidirectional check valve. So unidirectional check valve it helps to prevent the black flow of the air, prevent the black flow of the medical gases. It ensures the one-way flow from the oxygen cylinder, from the medical gas cylinder to the anesthesia machine. After the unidirectional check valve, to have a pressure gauge. So pressure gauge is nothing but it shows the what is the pressure present in the oxygen uh, pressure in the cylinders. It's a pressure gauge. After the pressure gauge, the very important structure is called primary pressure regulator. So primary pressure regulator is sent in all three lines. And this is the oxygen pressure regulator. So it is a pressure regulator. So the pressure regulator will helps to reduce the pressure when in the oxygen, when in the medical gas cylinder, when its pressure was more high, like in oxygen have a 2000 PSI and the nitrous oxide have a 760 PSI and air have so same as a 2000 PSI, same as oxygen. So it have a very high pressure. Now we have to need for reduce the pressure. So that that need will fulfilled by that pressure regulator. So that pressure regulator will reduce the pressure is 45 to 60 psi. So on a CCI machine have a two connection from the two connection for the gas medical gases. One is the cylinder supply, it's another one is a central line supply. So manifold supply. So now it's have a pipeline supply. Now it have a five plane supply. So a five plane supply and I have one, it's have a unidirectional check one and the pressure gauge. It is a unidirectional check one and pressure gauge. Unidirectional check valve which helps to prevent the black flow of the air and the pressure gauge will help to what is the pressure present in the five plane supply. So it is a five plane supply. And it is a unit action check one. It is a pressure gauge. It is a pressure gauge. Okay. Sure. 
So we have two line here. So after the pipeline supply, it have a pressure relief valve. Version all three lines. Pressure relief valve. So it is a pressure relief valve. So after the pressure relief valve, it have a second stage pressure regulator. Have a second stage pressure regulator. So it is a 45 to 60 PSI in pressure, but in common gas outlet, the pressure present in 4 to 6 PSI only. So we have to need the reduced pressure instead. So to fulfill that requirement, we have a second pressure regulator. The second pressure regulator or second stage pressure regulator is here. After the second stage pressure regulator, the oxygen have a uh, very some specific uh, special connections is here. So one is a master switch. So another one is a oxygen flush. So another one is a oxygen alarm. Oxygen failure safety alarm. So that oxygen failure safety alarm also is connected with other two gases. So it is the oxygen supply failure alarm. When oxygen pressure is reduced manufacture level, that is it will provide a hypoxic mixture delivery. To re to prevent the hypoxic mixture of delivery, it have oxygen failure alarm. When the oxygen supply is failure, it's also cut out the other gases also, air and nitrous oxygen gas also. So it is the one of the uh, hypoxic, uh, hypoxic card uh, failure safety alarm, work to failure safety alarm. So one of the safety measure in the anesthesia machine. Though that is a master switch and another one is the work to flush. Work to flush is the independent, independent parts in anesthesia machine. So then they have a Flow control valve. It's a flow control valve. Flow control valve. After the flow control valve, it have a after the flow control valve, it have a flow meter assembly. So it is a air and it's a nitrous oxide flow meter and it's oxygen flow meters. So we have to connect the line to the flow meter. So it is air flow meter and nitrous oxide flow meter and last one is the oxygen flow meter. Oxygen flow meter person should be in downstream nature to prevent the hypoxic mixture of delivery. So all flow meters together is connected to one beautiful material it's called a vaporizer it have an instrument that have vaporized uh, inhalation agents after the vaporizer it have a pop-up burn then it ends with lost part is common gas outlet it is a common gas outlet when oxygen or all other medical gases uh, travels via this line and to the common gas outlet. In common gas outlet, we have to connect the circuits or many breathing circuits to provide the anesthesia. Now, the oxygen plus is an independent part in anesthesia machine. It has a 35 to 75 liter per minute. Flow rate of oxygen will comes as a 45 to 60 PSI pressure so it will be connected to the common gas outlet it bypass the all material present in this line so it is a independent quartz in anesthesia machine and that have another one independent material is called auxiliary O2 flow meters
when the anesthesia machine master switch off the oxygen flow auxiliary oxygen flow meter is worked so it is also a independent uh, material present in the anesthesia machine here this is a simple line diagram of the anesthesia machine hope this video will be very clear about the what is the parts present in the anesthesia machine uh, i will meet the another video as soon as possible until then signing off jerry ascar this is paramedico genesis